I think the thing that I will always remember best about Lynn is my classes. I definitely became very, very close to my teachers. Um, there's two main ones for my career, and it's Dr. Wright and Dr. Kreff, and they've been truly amazing. Um, not only have they inspired us, like they made sure that classes were always fun and different, and I can't really speak for the other schools um, and at Lund University, but I know that in IR, um, the classes were really small, and most of them weren't really lectures, they were debates. So, be as multicultural as the school is, everyone had a very different opinion from a very different origin, and it just kind of helped me open your eyes, see what's out there, not from a book's perspective, but from people growing up there, having family there. So it was nice, that's definitely something that I think helped me grow even more than just academically. And that's in influencing me for Peace Corps. I mean, over the last four years, I guess everything has helped me shape who I am, which eventually made me take that decision to do this for two years. And I don't know if I can really pinpoint one event or one moment that made me decide, but overall, I think just being here, meeting the people I met, having the classes the way they were, the teachers, everything just made me decide. I think the thing that um, I fear the most is as independent as you may strive to be as a human being, you always rely on your friends or family. And I think that it's really going to be, it's going to test that, to know that people love me and people are supporting me, but to not feel it or hear it, because in all honesty, I don't really know yet how often I'm going to be able to talk to them or even reply to an email. But I think that it's a journey that I want to go through, to grow as a person. I think it's something that will make me strong enough to reach my bigger goals, such as working um, for United Nations one day, or I don't know, working for an NGO, whatever it is that I end up working at. I think that it's definitely something that I look forward to growing and living this experience at its fullest. The study tour to Cambodia was truly life changing for me. I think even growing in an underdeveloped country, you learn to see things, and as sad as this may sound, you get used to it. But being in a completely new country and getting to know the culture from a completely new perspective and having my two teachers, Cypher and Chet Bar, was amazing too because they helped us like open our eyes to everything that was out there, the history, how like the post-trauma um, from the war has impacted the entire society. I think it just, it was like a wake-up call of humanity needing help and knowing that it's in our hands to make a change. You definitely have to learn in life to explore what's out there because I think that if I haven't been exposed to many things that I wouldn't have realized my passion for this or even my strength in this. Like I would have never realized I had the drive to go through all this, to leave home, to say goodbye to my family, to go for two years and embark this mission. But going to Cambodia, I mean, like even hobbies, like things that you might think you have no talent for or that it's just not you. Maybe if you try it, you realize that you're the perfect person for it.